Alright guys, what is up and welcome back to Gary's Mod. And as you can see, we are on the place where my favorite character of Star Wars died. Yes. I'm not going to say it because I don't want to spoil unless so you have all probably have already seen it. But anyway, this is the Sarlacc pit right here. This is where Jabba the Hutt, I believe, resides. I haven't really watched any of the movies, that's just what I know based on what I've read on the internet. I know I'm a bad person. But anyway guys, we are going to be doing... The lightsaber mod. Alright, so first things first, uh, it puts you into a third person perspective, which is pretty cool. And uh, you left you left click to swing, there's different swing sounds and such, and that's pretty freaking awesome. So yeah, we're gonna actually try this out and so on and see how, uh, see how bad this thing hurts. Alright guys, so we have Iron Man as my guinea pig today, and we're gonna see what it looks like when you attack him with the lightsaber. Ooh! Okay, one, why did he sound like a girl? <laughs> Let's try that again. Alright, I have a few Iron Men set up right in front of me. And uh, apparently they all sound like women. And yeah, it's it's pretty overpowered. And uh, another thing you could do with this is, uh, I believe... Or not. Okay, I thought you'd run faster, but... As you'll see, there's four sleep down there, and you can see what those do, and you can actually change what type of force you want to use by holding the E key or your use key and pressing right click or left click to go the other way so right now we're at uh, let's try let's try re repulse alright guys so repulse you hold to charge for greater distance and you kill everybody close to you nice sounds sounds like a good force ability you can also push back everybody who is a bit further away but still close enough so we're gonna see what this looks like so you press right click and that didn't really do anything. Alright, we're gonna try that again. Whoa, wait, what? Alright, so after further, after further speculation, I realized if the saber just touches him, they die. So, yeah, that can be kind of overpowered. Alright, guys, we're gonna charge up Force Repulse. <sighs> that was sick. That was sick. Alright guys, so as you guys can see, I am surrounding myself with the Iron Man, and uh, those two guys died because they touched my lightsaber. But anyway, we're going to see what Force Repulse really does. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, we had another casualty. I'm going to try to look out where I point my saber, but anyway. <sighs> oh, that was sweet. And the weapons disintegrate too, as well as their bodies. That is an amazing power. Alright guys, next up is Combust, which ignites stuff in front of you. So I'm just going to press right click and... Oh! <laughs> He's on fire! Okay. That doesn't look like it feels too good. <laughs> yeah, he's dead. So I'm curious if you can combust other items. Uh, let's try it. Alright guys, here we have a washer machine. And uh, I'm going to right click it. And apparently you cannot. Alright, this time I got something wooden. Aha! So wooden things can combust, which is pretty cool. Yeah, I can see this power as being extremely, extremely overpowered. And by the way, guys, you can use this in multiplayer with your friends and have lightsaber duels. Unfortunately, I have no one to do that with. Uh, but uh, I, I would do it with Josh, but he had to get off and such. And uh, and besides, I think this this is kind of bugged in the multiplayer version. I'm not sure, but I read somewhere that it had issues. So So at least that's good, you know. We're not missing out on too much, at least. Uh, so, next up, guys, we have... Whoa! Force Leap. Now, Force Leap, you get to jump longer and higher, and you aim higher to jump farther and further. Okay, and higher. Press Control to negate fall damage, but stop moving for one second. Alright, so, whoa! So, yes, Control negates movement, which is pretty cool. Negates movement. Ne uh, negates the damage. So yeah, you could kind of abuse this a little bit. That is pretty cool. So yeah, guys, so that is the Force Leap. You can just do some kick-ass air battles with your friends. I can see stuff like that happening. Alright. Alright, the next up is Force Heal, which I'm going to have to take damage. I'm at 90 health, but I want to take a little bit more damage. Ooh. Ooh. Ow, bitch. Okay, so, as you can see, yeah, again, the lightsaber's very overpowered. I think it one-hits everything. 
But uh, we're gonna activate Force Heal and see what it does. I'll, I'll get a good look at my health. All right. All right. So you hold down you hold down the right click, and it slowly wastes your energy, or your Force energy, and it heals you. Now it doesn't really heal you that much, depending on how much energy you're depleting. So I'm not too sure of how how much it's worth to do it, but but yeah, it's pretty cool. It works just fine. Alright guys, so next up we have Absorb. Hold mouse 2 to protect yourself from harm. It doesn't work midair. Alright, so we're going to try this out. We're going to have to uh, change the weapons. Weapon override. Let's make it the SMG. Alright, now we're going to spawn, spawn Iron Man. Alright, so I'm activating my Absorb. You hold on the right click. As you can see, I'm not taking any damage at all. But my energy is slowly depleting. You can see just no damage at all. But the more they shoot you, the more dam the more it, it drains the energy, so... And if you just hold it down, it just passively drains it, so... So yeah, so that's pretty cool. And again, the lightsaber burns things. That's pretty cool, actually. The lightsaber burns things that you, you actually touch with it, which is pretty cool. It doesn't actually hurt the object, but it leaves a mark, and it's pretty cool. Alright, guys, so that's all the force powers, but that is not all that this one has to offer. Oh, no. Oh, and I forgot to mention. If you press R, you actually put your lightsaber away, and as you can see, you can just walk around you know, like, you know, like normal. Now, mind you, you cannot use any of the force powers while you have this, uh, while you have the lightsaber inside the, uh, the handle. But you can always just whip it out with pressing R. It's pretty sick, actually. I like it. It's pretty awesome. Alright, guys, so there's not just the lightsaber. You can actually get it as an entity if you want. Go into entities, and you'll see... Right under Robot Boy 655's entities, spawn the lightsaber, and you can actually use the fizz gun to pick it up and manipulate it in whichever way you wish. So we're gonna actually gonna test this out and see how well this works. All right, guys. So we have this Iron Man. We're gonna try to kill him. All right. So yeah, it's it's very violent. I can see how this would work very well. We're gonna spawn some good guys just so they won't shoot me. All right. Oop. Well, that works too. All right, so anyway, he died accidentally. That was unintentional, but... <laughs> yeah, that was just annihilation. Yeah, this thing literally one-hits everything. Now, I'm curious to how strong this thing actually is. All right, guys, so here I've spawned an antlion guard. And we're going to see how well this works. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that that's just it it literally does one hit everything. So yeah, that's kind of cheap. Now that I think about it. And yes, yeah, so it can kill yourself, so you want to be careful. I don't know why it's not killing me now though. So yeah, guys, so there is actually some options. I didn't even know you could do this. You go into lightsaber, and just by the way, this is the same guy who made the hoverboards mod that I did a video on uh, earlier this month, or last month, and you could change how your lightsaber actually looks. That is freaking awesome. You could change the color of it. You can make it a dark inner blade. You can make the width of the blade big, the length of the blade big. You can make the hum sound. Oh, that is cool. You can even customize it. Uh... I'll make it Darth Vader, why not? Swing sound, I'll make it Dark Saber. Ignition sound, make it dark. Alright, let's see what this looks like. Oh, that is sweet! Now, unfortunately. Oh, shit! <laughs> now, unfor now, unfortunately. Uh, wait, will this actually work? One second. Alright, guys, that is sick. You can actually change how the lightsaber looks when you're holding it. As you can see though, it's a little bit too long. So, this isn't just for tools, this is just for basically anything with your lightsaber. That is pretty cool. Alright, we're gonna see how much damage this thing can do. Wow. So yeah, it's... It's a little bit overpowered, I guess you could say. So yeah, guys, just 
ton of customization options. I mean, you can choose what the hilt looks like, the color of the of the saber. You can make the width, the length. You can make the hum sound different. You can make the dark inner blade so it looks dark, which is awesome looking. It can be enabled in spawn, like so much cool things. And there's some presets. Like here's Darth Maul's lightsaber. You can see what that looks like. As you can see, oh, I think he has a dual saber, I'm not sure. You can make Darth Vader's lightsaber if you want to. It's pretty freaking cool, guys. So much different customization options you can do. And the sabers work really well, the hum sounds look good. As you can see, it's pretty awesome, guys. Complete customization over the colors and everything. Alright guys, so I've placed enemies all over, and I'm going to put all my powers to the test and see how well this works. So I'm going to go with the Force Sleep. Ooh. Die, bitch! Alright, he's dead. Change the heal to heal some damage off. Kill him. Go for the Absorb to absorb some of the damage. Now this does not work in midair. Alright, so I'm almost dead, so I want to be careful. Alright, now we're going to use Repulse. Alright, so he's dead. Combust, this is going to be funny. Work! Okay, so Combust... <laughs> he's on fire. So Combust is a little bit buggy at first. Alright, so I want to leap. Now I want to be really careful because I'm almost dead, so I'm going to heal actually. There's still quite a few enemies left, so I'm going to try to be a little bit cautious. Right, I'm going to utilize my Absorb ability. Alright, he's dead. Absorb is doing wonders for me right now. Now, you can't attack while absorbing, so that's the issue. It's one issue right there. So you want to make sure that you use it cautiously. Alright, taking a bit of damage here, but I got my Absorb up. Alright, now that I'm pretty weak, I'm actually going to heal. Alright, so now I'm healing. Hopefully I can kill this guy. Let's see, uh, see if he can't one-hit me, hopefully. So I actually got a sneak attack on him. It's pretty funny. Alright, who's left? Now since that's pretty far, I'm actually going to use my leap to cover more distance. Do that so I don't take any fall damage. Alright, so there is an enemy over here. He's down, and there's one right here. Nice! Alright, so yeah, again, you don't even have to really attack as long as the saber hits them. It'll do a lot of damage. Alright, so it looks like there's just one more guy left. Oh, nope, two more. Alright, he's dead. One more left. No! So yeah, I had one guy left, and I had one health left. I did not realize I was that weak. So I should have healed, guys, but uh... You know what? There's no need. Cause you know what, we're just gonna, we're just gonna kind of be cheap and just poke him with the sword. So, so yeah, there we go. So that's it, guys. That's the lightsaber mod. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, amazing creator who made this mod. And uh, and if you guys like this video, don't forget to leave a like and comment some suggestions down below for future mod suggestions, and I would definitely review them and show them off. And uh, or if it's a map or so. Anything of that sense. And don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Twitter because I have those and uh, you can get the latest updates on those websites, especially Twitter. And so yeah guys, so if you guys like this video, don't forget to subscribe as well for more videos. And until next time guys, thanks for watching and farewell.